Titus chapter 2, who gave himself for us to redeem us from every lawless deed and to purify for himself a people for his own possession. I wonder, you know you've been bought back, but did you see that you're pure? We got a lot of Christians that don't think they're pure. I mean, Ephesians tells us that Jesus did what he did so that we would be spotless and blameless. And here Titus says you're pure. We got a lot of Christians who are trying to get pure, but this says we're pure. He did it to purify us. Did he do it? Yes. Did he purify us? Yes. Are we blameless and spotless? Yes. Like a bride that he is excited about. And one day there will be that wedding, so to speak. I mean, that grand celebration visibly of what's already happened spiritually. And one day, that'll be awesome, but do you realize that God was absolutely thrilled to save you and indwell you and transform you, and now He treats you as if you've never sinned a single day in your life. I know you're bummed. You're bummed about your sins. You're bummed about your performance. You're frustrated. You're even angry. People call us all the time. They're angry about their struggle. Why do I keep struggling with this? Why can't I stop? For men, it's usually lust and pornography. And Why can't I stop? And in one sense, you want to ask, what would stopping do for you? Because if their answer is, stopping would make me right with God, stopping would make me pure, stopping would make me closer to God, then they've got it wrong. See, let's stop because we're close to God. Let's stop because we're pure. Because we belong as as people of His possession. Let's stop because of what He's already done. Let's not stop to get. The only thing we get is our sanity back. (laughs) The only thing we get is peace of mind. But we don't get closer, we're united with Christ. And we don't get forgiven, we're forgiven once for all. But we do get sensible. And we do find peace. And we find our joy again. Because we're not made for that. We belong to Him and we're one with Him. So we're not stopping to get. We're stopping because we've got. Because He redeemed us.